Hi, today we're um, at my workshop obviously at Tam's Auto Cat Lansville. Um, I've got Justin's fam's car here, which is a Honda S2000, which is just over there. Um, what he's asked us to do is um, he's suspecting that the injectors aren't actually flowing as well as it should. So what we're going to do is um, we're going to sort of bench test it on the injection machine. Um, today what we're going to do is do a couple of tests on it before we clean it on the ultrasonic bath. Um, the first test we're going to do is do a hold and open test um, and then follow up by a leakage test. Okay, and then we'll slowly um, open and flow test and pulse it. So, ready to go. So the first step we're going to do is just, of course, we already hooked it all up. Okay, so we're going to just switch it on. Adjust our pressure regulator. Okay, so we're running about two, three bars. As you guys can see, right, the spray pattern that's coming out, it's quite good. Okay, you can actually see how it's actually come directing the spray pattern, which is pretty much how it's supposed to look like. That's at the present moment, the injectors are being pulsed at 8,000 RPM at 6 milliseconds. Okay, so as you guys can imagine, that's quite high. You know, he's revving its tits off. Okay, so the next step, what we're going to do, do a leak test. And what we're doing, part of the leak test, is making sure there's no leakage at the pins itself, yep, the yep. injector pins. So we'll just give it a couple of seconds, make sure there's no dribbles coming out through these injectors, which is good. This fuel pressure is still the same. It doesn't drop any pressure. Okay, so now we can stop the machine. What we're going to do is we're going to flow test the injectors now. What we're looking for is at the same time as the spray pattern and also the amount of fluid that's actually coming out. We need to measure it and make sure they're all the same. Right, so we'll just let it settle. As you guys can see, it's roughly about 110 mil. So that tells me they're all okay. But we haven't actually cleaned it yet, okay? All right? Yeah, yep. So the next step now, Justin was saying to us that he suspect that the injectors are breaking down at high revs. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually pulse the injector. As you guys can see, we actually are going to pulse it at 8,000 RPM, which is at six milliseconds. Okay, it's not something you do on the road, but because he's complaining at top end, we're taking it to the max. So we'll see what happens. Have a look at it and listen to the injectors go. Just pause it for a second. 